Well, good morning, y'all. I want to give you a little faith principle. We're believing God. Been talking to you about keys to answer prayer. Well, corresponding actions is a big part. The Bible says faith without works is dead, or in other words, it's non-productive. Well, works is corresponding action. You believe you healed, get up and get dressed like you're going to get out and do something. Uh, don't call in sick. All of those are actions that we do. Well, now watch this. I made a mistake here a while back, but I changed it. I've got this nice car. It's, we've enjoyed it for several years now, and it's, it's getting a lot of miles on it. So I started driving my old car so that I wouldn't wear this one out. Now that is a statement of lack. That's saying God may not be able to provide me with another new one. So see, when you start hoarding things up, you start holding on to what you got, it's a corresponding action that I'm poor, I'm without, and God's not going to take care of me. So you got to get rid of it. You remember that Abraham had to get rid of that Ishmael before he could receive the promise? Well, now this is what I did, and I think this will help you. When I realized the reason I wasn't driving the good car was because I was afraid that I was going to wear it out, and I was driving the old car, which, by the way, wasn't a bad car, try to conserve it. It dawned on me what I was doing, and I gave that old car away. I said, you know, I am not going to let that keep me from receiving God's best. Now, I haven't had a miracle yet because I gave that away several months ago, I guess maybe eight or nine months ago now, but I acted against my lack. So let me tell you this. If your body's hurting, act against that. Get up in the morning, get dressed, be ready to do what you want to do, do things you can't do, or if you don't have any money, act against that. Sow a seed, you know, maybe if you've only got a dollar, it's a seed. It's not the size of the seed that counts, it's the seed. And start acting on what you believe. And if you believe in wrong, then go back to the Word of God. Plant the seed of the Word of God until your faith rises in the Word of God. Now, I was just talking to Pat about this. You know, they don't even make this car anymore. Hey, God said, if I go to the Father in the name of Jesus and don't have it healed, He said He'd make it for me. So from somewhere out there, God's going to do exactly what my desire is. Watch this. Jesus said this in John 15, 7. If you abide in me and my words abide in you, you shall ask what you will, and it shall be done unto you. Your will becomes God's will when you're abiding in the word. Hey, I got to go get rid of the lack around you. Get rid of all those other symptoms around you because God's looking for somebody to bless, and I believe you're the one. Hey, you remember all day, watch this, Jesus is Lord. Yep, thank God the word works.